Hey, welcome back. A lot's changed in the past week. I didn't take much video on it, but this tree that was here is no longer there. And we got a roof on and I'm starting the windows and doors. So hopefully I can finish this side of the windows today. All right, so I'm gonna attempt to put this window in by myself. I think I can do it, but we'll see. So I got this sill here sealed up and I have a 16th shim to level off the window when it comes in here. And I'm gonna do my best to center it from the outside. I'll put a couple temporary screws to hold it in place so I can come back in here and check the side to side. I have a laser set up outside and I set it to a piece of the sill on that window. That way I can have a visual and uh, make sure down hard on this sill is gonna be the same plane as that. So see how it goes. Okay, looks like the laser is right where it needs to be, nice. That worked out pretty well. It's actually really good. I don't know if I could just, I could probably work with that. I think right there is probably good. All right, let me go inside and look at that. Yeah, I like that. that top over actually I think it's I think it's perfect and nail it up what do you think is that OSHA approved All right, so I got my staging set up. I'm gonna prep these windows here and put some trim on them. Flashing tape right over the seam here, the seam and the nails, leaving myself an eighth of an inch in here so I can put a bead of silicone when I put the trim on there. And that should make it pretty watertight. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna make this trim so this window is exactly two feet wide. So that top trim, I'm going to add seven inches to it to make up for the side trim. So the top is going to be two feet, seven inch. And the side here is going to be 42. Short side to short side. So 42 inches short to short because I have a sole down here that's going to be on a slight angle so I'm gonna bevel that that way it fits in nice 
So you can cut this with a saw. This is a specific blade for hardy board. Just um, beware of the dust. It is dusty. You don't want to breathe it. You don't want to breathe silica. So maybe wear a mask. All right, so I got my trim pieces and instead of screwing through the face of this, what I'm gonna be using is these James Hardy aluminum tabs. So basically you staple these to the back of this and then fasten it to the wall that way. I did some of these yesterday and I had a real tough time getting this stapler to send the staples through that aluminum so I'll try it again today so before you go crazy you got to think about what you're doing so I'll make this the right hand side so I want my staples on this side here all right because that's my bevel and here's the opposite side so I'm going to be putting them on this side and then this is my top. Doesn't really matter the side, but there's more meat right there, so I'll put them. No pencil, but I'll put them on this top. And the other thing to keep in mind is how this is all gonna go together, because you don't want these plates to interfere with one of these other ones. So like on the bottom here, so I'll be having the sill basically like this and then I have the window frame right here so I could probably put this over here I would just have to install this first or you know I could just put it just like that and that should work out fine too let me try that out and see how that works see how that works I'm gonna have to go in and grab my vice grips cuz I guarantee you I'm gonna have an issue with these stables Nice, that one worked. That one worked. It did kind of crack this. You see, it's kind of cracked, but it's not on the face. So, I'm just gonna continue on. Maybe I won't go sideways like that. Let's got one there. I can do one here, one here. I have to just keep in mind of where this next piece is gonna go because that's gonna have a tab on it also. So I might just do them all on the side. Yeah, see that right there? That did not want to make it through. That's no good. I'm gonna have to pull that out because that's gonna be a high spot now. That one made it. And that one made it, but that one didn't. So let me go get my vice grips. All right, so that one went in. So this top one, you gotta remember you have the window flange here, so you don't wanna protrude into the window flange. I could do that right there. That'll work. That'll work. That'll work out good. That 
worked out good. Yeah. So there's that one ready to go. I'll do the same thing to this one, but we're going on this side. So here's my top one. So this one here, I can put right here, and these tabs won't interfere. I'm going to be a zombie with my zombie. Didn't make it. All right, so these are ready to go. Let's go put them in. Oh, you got us some drinks. Did you grab that or did mommy give that to you? Oh, oh I grabbed that. You grabbed it? Yeah, I want to sit down. This has been in the house for a long time. Everyone's afraid to drink it, but now I have no choice. Zero sugar. All right. <clears throat> Thanks, bud. Oh, did you see that? Do you know what kind of bird that was? called a cardinal. Yeah. Hmm. It's like a salsa water. Hold on, I'm almost done. Let me uh, put this up here. And then we'll sit down and have some drinks. Yeah, I have my secret now. All right, well, hold on, don't, don't go underneath of me. Let me use a finished nailer just to put a couple little tacks on it. All right, so this one is this side here. Wish that thing had a hook on it. Be good. Yeah. That'll be good. I like that. That looks pretty good. It is new tool. That's nice and tight. That works. Sure does. Hold on, let me put them all up first. I'm almost ready, bud. I'm almost ready. Oh, yeah. That's gonna be good. Well, Daddy's gonna have a drink, too. Daddy will join you. Let's get this going. These are just Galvi, like, inch and a half ring shanks. Pretty good. That's what I like to see. I like to see wood right away. That means I'm going through the holes of the nailing flange of the window. That's what I was aiming for. So if you notice, the screws on this aren't like, you know, dead center of the window and then over. I lined it up to go through the holes of the uh, nailing flange. I think, I think that came out pretty good. 
think this one I could actually roll this up a little bit, which I will probably do. I'll put a shim there, get that tight, because it does look like it's rolling down a little, which I can fix. Right behind you, buddy. You like it? You think that looks good? Yeah. Let's take all the toys off today. Now we're gonna go to the next one though. Let's have a uh, let's have a drink break. <laughs>